Well, we can start by what I don't mean. I don't mean taking innocent women at gunpoint and handing them over to useless men, which is essentially the accusation. You know, it was really interesting to watch that unfold. What I meant was that monogamy as, a, as something that's socially uh, valued is, appears to be essentially a human universal. That doesn't mean that human beings are universally monogamous, because obviously we're not. We can be serially monogamous, and some people are players and have multiple partners and all of that, but there's a strong proclivity across known societies to tilt towards monogamy. And the enforcement is social norms. It's like, think about it. It's, I can't believe that I even have to say this. <laughs> Your son just gets married, and he comes home and he says, Guess what, Dad? I've been screwing around. And what do you do? You pat him on the head and you say, Hey, good work, kid. That's, that's my young man. <laughs> right? Well, no. You see, you, you're not happy about that. And he doesn't tell you because he knows you're not going to be happy about it. And that's enforced monogamy. It's part of the social structure. It's like, what, and what else is enforced monogamy? It's like, well, most people want a monogamous relationship. And if they enter into a relationship with someone, they're not happy if that person goes and sleeps around, right? Most of you, you would be happy if that happened. It's like, not being happy, that's part of enforced monogamy. It's part of this, you know, and you might have noticed, you probably did, polygamy is actually illegal. You can't have multiple marital partners simultaneously. That's enforced monogamy. It's like, an, and it's an anthropological term, and it's been known for a hundred years by anthropologists, most of whom are left-leaning, by the way, because that's how it goes, that monogamous social structures are one of the ways that you keep children raised properly so that they have a relatively stable environment, and that you keep male aggression, especially the aggression of young men, under some degree of social control. It's not a mystery. The fact that I got in trouble for that, it's, it's kind of a miracle. It's like, well, don't, don't you notice that we enforce monogamy in, in like almost every way? And that the same thing happens all over the world in all sorts of diverse societies? And then when we deviate from that, that there's a price to be paid? So, and so that's why like, I'm a New York Times pariah, is because I think that monogamy all things considered is a good idea. So, okay, fine. <laughs>